Hey, what's up? It's Alex here from iDesign Solutions here to talk about the reverse double four bar lift, specifically with Vex IQ. Now, I know this has kind of been looked at before with the EDR side of things, but I really wanted to focus on it and go a little more in depth with the IQ. Now, people love the double verse four bar because it's got a really high lift um, capacity, but it also contracts to a really low robot. And this is just a simple four bar, one half of the whole entire lift. And a good example of this is the current robot Flex that Vex put out this year. Um, it shows you how the parallelogram nature of the four bar lift makes it so that as you, as you lift up an object, it's going to stay at that exact orientation the whole time. And now the key to the double reverse four bar is this opposing gear rotation in the center of the lift. Now to show it in action, as one lift expands, the other lift is going to expand with it simultaneously, but in the opposite direction. Another key to making double reverse four bars is elastics. You want to start with a high tension and three points far apart, and then as the lift comes up, you want those points to come together and release the tension, and this natural elasticity is going to help you get more power on your lift. They do tend to be pretty heavy, so elastics are very helpful. You can also use higher torque settings, and you can also mount your mowers lower on the robot, so that way there's less weight in the lift itself. Obviously, I'm not very good with this, and this isn't really a great robot, but I just wanted to put something together to show you. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any other questions or there's any other videos you'd like to make, just let us know.